the news is in. Contrary to popular belief, most people do not want their instruments、uh, broken in shipping.、Uh, to avoid this, the best way to ship a shamisen, or as we say in the business, shashing,、uh, you've got to fully disassemble the instrument. This is what my partner Yanaka san does for all Tokyo Agaki and beginner shamisen. And so far, we've had less than one half of 1% of our shamisen have any kind of damage in shipping. And of that, it was relatively minor. It basically comes down to taking it all apart, putting on the joint protectors, karitsuki, shwing, then just putting a cushion around it. If you have ordered one of our shamisen, it'll arrive in a condition just like this, plus a box. Uh, let's figure out how to assemble it. First, we take our dough and we look、um, in the square hole. One end has kind of a straight line on top, and the other end has a curve. This will match up with the end of the saru, which is the heel here. This has a straight line here, and this curves. So the indentation on the dough is where, boom, this struck and connected in. What we're going to first do is Find the straight line, straight line there, and just match them up. So, this is the top. It'll only go in one way. And then just give a little tap, so it'll make it snug for now. Then, when it's in our lap, we'll put our thumb on this end of the karitsuki, and then with our fingers here, we're just going to grip and make sure it goes straight up. Easy. Next, we're going to connect the nakazao to the shimozao. And this only goes on one way. The heel end of the sole is thicker by just a few millimeters than the top end. First, take one karitsugi off, and then carefully line it up and see if they do line up. You can feel,、uh, look around the edges. And they should come together flush. If they come together flush, you know that's the side. However, if you turn it around, because this end is thinner, when it、uh, connects to the wider end, you'll find, for example,、uh, this edge sticks out more. So if you feel a bump when you put your finger around,、uh, don't push at all, just stop. Take it out gently and turn it around. Like so. So, when it's at this point, you feel it all feels flush, we're good. Then just push downward. Click. Oh, that clicked down too. Okay, double click. And there we go. That's flush. Flush. Now,、uh, we connect the kamizawa, the top section. Connected to the nakazal. And this, we start here. We can use our other fingers to make sure the channels line up. And then go straight down, like so. Then just push downward. And you'll hear that satisfying click. Alrighty, so, sal is set. Now we want to fully connect the heel to the dough. The best way to do this, the standard way, is to kind of use momentum and such to just、uh, pop it in, as the kids say. And be sure, use downward pressure, don't you know, twist or go to the side with the saw. Re -re -re Replay! There we go, clack. When you hear a clack, you know it's all the way in.、Uh, and if you're having trouble, put a little oil. Never hurts anybody.、Uh, that can really help. Get a full connection. Lastly, we want to put in the itomaki. They come in a box like so. The topmost itomaki has the largest hole, and that hole is closer to the middle than any of the others. So, this larger hole we know goes onto the top. The next will have two white dots on the end. That will show that it's the middle. Slide that in. And the last. Boom. Okay. And there we go. Shamisen is fully assembled.、Uh, now, I do tend to make a video on this later, but repetition can't hurt,、um, usually.
The itamaki are only held in with friction, so after you string and as you're tuning up, the itamaki are going to just gradually slip out of the holes. So to ensure that it's tight, use your thumb on the inside of the itogura, the peg box, and just kind of push it inward while you twist. Note, you have to twist while pushing inward to make it lock. Pushing without twisting doesn't work. Uh, and so do that, and once it feels tight, you can take your thumb out and then you just twist normally and should be fine. Once it starts to turn a little too easily, put your thumb back in and lock it again. Otherwise, it'll just spin out. And there we go. We have our fully assembled uh, shamisen, in this case, the rose. Um, yeah, we learn stuff. Now, how about disassembling while we're here? Sounds good. So, Ichimaki, just give a little twist and an outward pull. And it pops up. Same. Like so. Okay, so the first section we'll take off is the kamizawa. First thing we do is put it on our lap with the shamisen facing away from you. Then look for the joint line and put your hand just below the joint. And then put your thumb on the joint that's part of the kamizawa. And we're gonna use this to push upwards. While we do, make sure that your fingers are below the joint line. And then with this hand, we're going to whack it off. Uh, make sure that you don't go above the line because we don't want to be putting stress on this joint. The strike is gonna make vibration to coax the kamizawa out. So make sure, make sure you're striking on the nakazawa. Start to have a crack. And out it goes. Next, shimozawa. So the same, put your fingers and such on the shimozawa, not above. And over here, this is the joint line. So we're making sure all our fingers are below. Thumb will go above. So the thumb is touching the joint for the nakazawa. This, we line this up with these fingers ensuring that we're not striking the nakazawa, just the shimozawa. And when you strike, have a loose, um, kind of a cupping like this. Bong, bong. Out it goes. Lastly, for the shimozawa, the pro way to take it off is just striking it against the floor because it's just held in with friction. And out it pops. Next, we match the kabitsuki up with the joint. Note, only one matches up with each individual joint. They're not interchangeable. So to make it helpful, you can draw lines uh, on the inside. For example, there's four joints, so you could uh, draw four lines here, four lines here, so you know they match up. And just pop it in until you hear a click. Anything involving connecting joints together, be very gentle and just give it a light, uh, a light push to see if it fits. Like this case, it doesn't. So then we just gently try the other end. Um, and there. If it fits, it'll go in easily. Nothing has to be forced. Lastly, kamizawa. Click. Itomaki. And do. Shamisen disassembled, you are ready to ship this to yourself because why would you ever want to get rid of it? Kyle Abbott, Bachian. <laughs>